this video, we are going to create the gallery page. So file open. I already have the gallery page created, but I need to go in there and add the links to cabins. Okay, in my navigation bar, if you haven't yet, please go ahead and do that. And then to gallery as well. All right, and now I would like to add a panel in here. <clears throat> so now let's go to the very bottom here. And all right, oh, we have the carousel items here is what I'm looking at. So let's go delete the carousel. Okay, so here we go. So, expand that all the way down to here. There we go. So let's go delete that. All right, and save it. All right, so I should just have the navigation here for my gallery. Let me go take a look. So if I go to gallery, I should only have my navigation. Now let's go to insert and bootstrap components and let's go add a tab. All right, so let's go see what that looks like. Refresh. So we have tab one, two, and the three with the drop down. So I don't really want the drop down tab. So I'm going to go in here and change that. Okay, so here I have the drop down tab here. I don't really want that. I'm going to get rid of that. Also delete that comment out. So I just want a regular tab. So I'm going to copy two and paste that there. All right. And of course, there's that kind of syntax error that shows up here, a warning in red. It says the ID must be unique. Of course, I had copied it exactly. So just like in the last example, I need to go call this pain three, okay? And then call it tab three. And I need to change it here as well. Okay, so here. I have the drop down one and drop down two. I don't actually have that anymore. So I'm gonna delete the drop down one and drop down two. Instead, I'm going to have, and this is in the content panel, right? This shows you what's in the content. So here we go. So instead I have pane three. Okay, and there we go. and content three. Let's go file, save. And let's go take a look at it. And here, so now I have tab one, tab two, tab three has content three. Okay, that's perfect. So let's go over to Dreamweaver and let's go see, Ashley, let's go over to our cozycabins.ca website and let's go see what they have under cabins. Okay, on the, under the cabins page they have, sorry not cabins page, under the gallery page. Let's go see what they have. So they have cabins, packages, and activities. Okay, so let's go to Dreamweaver and, and the, instead of tab one, let's call it cabins. What was the second one? Packages and activities. Packages and activities. Okay, so here in the paragraph for tab one, I am going to have this text here. Okay. And there we go. And content two is going to have this text here. And 
content three is going to have this text here. All right, and let's go file, save, and let's go take a look at Cozy Cabins. It goes up. Cabins, packages, activities. All right, there we have it. Now this looks a little bit bland. It would be nice if you could add um, what we have here, these buttons and these images here as well. All right, so let's go uh, and download those buttons and images. So I'm gonna go over here, save image as, save here, save image as, and save, and here, save image as, and save, and there we go. And you can insert those images. You can also add some buttons. So I would like you to, this time, on your own, go and explore. Maybe you can enter some buttons, okay? And see what you can come up with.